Hello everyone and welcome to my new tutorial. I'm SV and today I'll show you how to make this picture. Ok, a few days ago from one of my subscriber I received like this message. Do you know how to make texture in Redshift? And he gave me some a link. So check it. As we can see on some metal cylinder we have some logo. It's textured with alpha and uh, Matthias Holzer, I, I hope it's correct, asked me how to do it in Redshift. So, if you are ready, we will start. We are in Cinema 4D and before start this tutorial we have to prepare some uh, PNG file, some logo uh, with alpha channel. So uh, I use Adobe After Effect. We are going in Adobe After Effect and I have like a, on the transparency I put some text in black color. So first it by SV, Motion, Cinema 4D tutorial and subscribe. Uh, only 5 frames with 5 different words. Uh, you can load and make any, I don't know, any logo what you like in Photoshop or anywhere where is you like, but usually I use uh, Adobe After Effects. So when everything ready, you go to composition and go to render quite. What settings I'll use? Go to output module and change PNG. Inside in the channel, make it alpha, only alpha, not necessary ARBG, only alpha channel. Make OK and just a render. So somewhere here I have four different files, oh, sorry, five different files with alpha channel. OK, now we are going in my Cinema 4D program and first of all I will create a cylinder. So, some parameters, I, I make some wheelet, maybe some, I don't know, 5 centimeters will be good. 3, very nice, will be 3 like this, so I'm going to display and display with lines. Mm, when everything ready, what I do, make a table, go to point selection, and select these points. Select these points and make like this. So like this. You can check these techniques and later you can do this with any kinds of Coca-Cola or with something, it's absolutely up to you. So it's collected, it's ready. After that we are going to selection tool, going to live selection and select somewhere here. Like this. Select set selection and you have like this. Ok, so very nice, it is ready. Uh, now we are create a, some redshift material. So we are going to redshift render, set up redshift, going to basic, we no need any IPR and bucket, we will use, yeah, like this, for a moment like this, for final render we will use other one. Ok, uh, apply this material to my cylinder, make a copy of this material, this will be a base, this will be a text, ok, very good. So make this material with, I don't know, maybe green color, just to show you what is going on. So apply also to my cylinder and inside in this material you can see selection, take this selection, drag and drop. And what, can see, what we can see? So, uh, all my cylinder have a gray color and area which is selected have a green color, like it should be. So, very nice. Now we are going to texture. Base. I like to make it metal. So, going inside. Uh, for metal, as you saw my previous tutorial, some, some of them take out diffuse we no need going to Fresnel, make it metalness and take it white color. Routeness, I don't know, maybe 0 0.3, I will use 0 0.3. Well, it is done, very nice. Uh, 
and now I am go to my text. And now please keep attention because it's it's not so easy to understood, but when you will follow to my tutorials, I hope it will be very, very simple for you. Okay, first of all, we are taking my texture. First texture will be by SV. We will start from this texture. Take and put here. After that, we need to make a two different materials. Material 1 and Material 2. And we need some Material Blender. Ok, uh, first of all, Material number 1, this material, should be absolutely same like your Material Base. Absolutely same settings. In other way, you will have mistake. So, Diffuse Color 0, Metalness, White, and 0 0.3. Check this. Diffuse 0, 0 0.3, metalness and white. Ok, very nice. Going back. Going back. This will be our uh, setup this uh, material. We can, I don't know. It is possible to rename? Yes, it is possible to rename. We will put like base. Very nice. Setup it for base material in our blender. And this setup here. So what we have? Uh, if I make a render now, I cannot see nothing. Of course, I cannot see nothing because I haven't any light. So I create any some some dome light, just just for checking what is going on. Again, render and check. Yeah, I think I need give something somewhere on from my desktop. Ok, yes, very good. As you can see, like this, yes. If this material will be not same like this material, for, for example, roadness, yes, we will put roadness less, 0 0.1. You can see some small difference between this and this material and it will be problem. So, as I told you, like this material and your base material should be absolutely the same settings. Ok, then we are apply this uh, texture like layer number one blend color and this material we will apply like layer color number one and we already have some text very good so going to texture and make rotation for 90 degrees it will be like this and i cannot see nothing because we forget about one more setting uh, push for this material is uv mapping is good, not necessary to change. But this material, which is selected, should be like a flat. And you can see, we already have something. So now I will play a little bit with uh, lens, maybe just a little bit reduce, maybe 5, reduce here, ok, 10. So I think maybe 80. Yeah, very nice. No, it's too much. I think it's 5. So it's about at center. About center. And looks like... Now maybe maybe I will reduce a little bit. And make more. Ok, yes. It is in the center and I can see everything. So it's very simple how to add, a add any text or any logo to your any object. You can use a cans of, I don't know, any soft drink, a bottle of wine, or any logo of your metal robot or something, it doesn't matter. You have absolutely same ways, same ways how to create it. So, this material we can play, for example, any green color, and you see it's coming green color. We can make it uh, roadness, we can do everything what we like, but for my tutorial I use I use this material, self-illumination material, apply, and what I have like this. So, it will be green color. It will be green color. I very like it. Ok, I hope you are understood what is going on and what we will do now. What we will do now. So, uh, I no need any dome light. I need only this cylinder. Copy of this cylinder 
and copy this texture. One, two, three, four, five. Totally will be five because I have five different words and will be five cylinders. Going to second one, change what I need. I need change only, where is this, where is this composition? I need change only this, nothing more and color of my motion, motion. I think motion will be red one. Very nice. Just apply here. Going next. Change PNG file for Cinema 4D. I don't know. Cinema 4D maybe will be some, some with this color. So why not? Why not? Very nice. Apply somewhere here. Going to next. What is this? It will be a tutorial. I don't know, maybe tutorial will be with, with pink color. Very good. And last one will be subscribe. I don't know, subscribe I will do with yellow, with yellow color. So why it's not working now, I don't know, but if I push one more time, yeah, you see it, it is working, but not here. It just doesn't matter. So what we will do now, we are going to my MoGraph and cloner. Put all my cylinders inside to the cloner. Inside in the cloner, change a grid array. I don't know, I will use five, five and sorry, 110 and random. Random, this is very important. What I have, oh, disaster. So little bit increase size like this, little bit increase like this, maybe 700, maybe 700 and we will check how many I need. Okay, maybe more, 2000. So very nice. What next? Select cloner, go to MoGraph, cloner and use a random. Inside in the random I go to parameters. I don't know, 10, 10, yes, and rotation, little bit change rotation, 20 degrees, 20 degrees, and 20 degrees. Okay, I have like this, something, something, something strange. So pick up, create a, some, sorry, some disk, I no need cube, sorry. Create some disk, make big radius, maybe like this, and, and what I need now? Uh, take a disk, go to tags and select a simulation tag, collider body. Uh, bounce will be, I don't know, maybe 10% and friction will be 100%. Uh, now go to cloner, tag, simulation tag and rigid body. Inside in rigid body, first of all, we're going to collision. Tag, apply to children and individual elements all. Bounce also will be only 10 and friction will be 100. So very nice. Uh, not necessary to make any additional settings. Mm, what we will do now, we are create a composition, maybe 300 frames, we will see. And just play. Okay, dogs, look at this, look at this. Very nice. So it is done. Now we are going closer, maybe like this. Find a good way. Uh, going to output 1920, 1080, and going to options, configuration, view, and increase just to see a renders. So very nice. Uh, I think it will be enough, maybe a little bit pick up. And one more. This material also we will apply to my disk, like a metal. Okay, uh, when everything done, just check what I have. I have like this and it looks like not so beautiful. I forget to change some settings. So before final render, go to uh, Redshift settings, go to system and increase bucket 256 up to maximum. After that, don't forget, go to integration and disable default light. We no need it. 
because uh, I use self-illumination material and I like to receive illumination only from this area. As you can see inside in my composition, I haven't any uh, redshift light and if I haven't any redshift light, Redshift automatically calculate with any default light. So it should be disabled. Don't forget, this is very important. Okay, and finally, we are going to render basic and increase, I don't know, maybe, maybe, maybe 256, 256, like this, and, and that's all. So render and check it. So, okay. Uh, Render is done, as you can see, we have some very interesting picture with Cinema 4D by SV, some tutorials. I cannot see any word with subscribe. Oh yeah, I can see motion and I cannot see any subscribe. So it doesn't matter if you like this tutorial, subscribe please, uh, share to your friends, put like and thank you for your attention. Goodbye friends.